It's time for a special back to school edition of District Wins. Okay, first up, let's check in on Cape Elementary School, where Superintendent Dr. Savage, along with School Board Chair Mr. Fisher, visited the students on their first day back. They even participated in a Four Corners team building activity with Mrs. Lee's class. Take a look at this, as Lee County Sheriff Carmine Marcino stopped by South Fort Myers High School to greet the students, faculty, and staff for this first day of school. The sheriff visited many classes and wished all the students a safe and amazing school year. What a significant start to the new school year over at Franklin Park Elementary School. Our Panthers were so excited to finally be in their pristine new building. Let our new adventures begin. What a unique way to welcome in the 2024-25 school year at the Alva School. We'd like to say thanks so much to Amanda at Happy Hearts for gifting these Alva Ramblers with this masterpiece. It was an extraordinary first day for our students at Island Coast High School. We wanted to give a huge thank you to members of Step of Faith Ministries for providing coffee and donuts to all of the staff and students. You made our Gators feel so special as we start a new year. Hey, let's check out the first day at Horns Marsh Middle School. It was simply an amazing day full of collaboration, team building, and critical thinking. Now, what will the rest of the year bring? Finally, the new school year is here, and we already have graduates in barbering and cosmetology at Cape Coral Technical College. Well-deserved congratulations to you all. If you'd like to see your school featured in District Wins, send us your photos and information to news at leeschools.net.